What's going on YouTube? It's another Albu Max video and today I'm going to be doing something very simple but um it might help out a couple people because uh, if you're definitely new to an iPod Classic but not just the iPod Classic oh well, this is not the iPod Classic, this is technically the iPod Video 5th generation but any iPod with a screen for the most part is capable of using a thing called Rockbox and Rockbox is basically essentially a jailbreak for it. It allows you to have like a custom firmware on it basically to where you can do a lot more things than obviously on a main, main iPod. You can do emulation on it, play uh, games, uh, custom stuff, custom settings, stuff like that. And the one thing I'm going to be showing you from this, uh, I won't be showing you how to install Rockbox just because there are very good videos already out there showing how to do that. And so I, I just wouldn't want to waste my time doing that when there's other videos that people have made that are very good. But one I'm going to show you is very simple, is once you get your Rockbox installed and set up, ready to go, is going to be custom themes. So as you can see here, this is the main theme that will be downloaded on it already. It's kind of bland, I mean it's, it's alright, but there's obviously a lot of other things you can download on here. So. If you want to go onto your computer now and open up a browser and go to Rockbox where you downloaded Rockbox at, you can click on themes and see all the extra themes that are on here. If I can get my camera to focus. So here's some themes. You can hover over it and see how the menu is going to look with like it playing songs. So this is like uh, like an iPod like classic type theme. Like you're going to get the... Uh, album cover on the side and then you know your main stuff here so that's made to make it more look like an iPod which is actually kind of nice so you really don't need it if you want to feel like because you can switch over from Rockbox to back to the iPod you know um, firmware no problem but if you want to just keep it on Rockbox but have that look of the iPod that's definitely the one you want to get and there's other ones here too that are like that as well but um I have this one downloaded and I have this one downloaded but I'm going to show you this one this is definitely one that stood out to me it's like a doodle kind of drawing type theme it looks really cool so we're going to go ahead and do that and what you would want to do is you're going to want to hit download so I'll go ahead and download this again um, you're going to open it up show in folder and then once you have it here you're going to want to ex extract it it doesn't matter really where you extract it to, but you can just extract it anywhere. Extract, and then you're going to get a Rockbox file right here. So this, at this point, you're going to want to plug in your iPod, which I can do. I just got to set this down real quick. So we're going to unplug the iPod in. You can see it's synced up. So now, on here, it opens up your iPod with the menu. So all you really want to do is drag this file that uh, got extracted from the themes over into Rockbox or you can just do it to Craig's uh, your iPod, whatever the iPod name is, and you can just do it like that. So we'll just go ahead and put it in there. I'm going to cancel that out because I already have it in there. But you'd go ahead and do that and do uh, put it on your iPod and then once it's done uh, downloading, you can go ahead and exit out do whatever and eject your iPod so took the iPod off the cord here the charge cable and now we're gonna go back into here so to find themes it's very simple just go to settings and then it says theme settings and then browse theme files and as you can see here we have the iClassic theme and then we're gonna do the we're gonna just go ahead and click pen and paper plus so once that loads, you can see it changing. So now you have a cooler, nicer looking theme. Definitely I like this a lot better than the what comes standard with it. So you can see here, we can go into music here and see how that looks. So that's cool, it shows the album cover, obviously, and it has it in its own little nice little themed little pencil uh, doodle thing, which is really cool. 
So definitely I recommend doing this and you can download as many themes as you want. Uh, I'm doing this on a iPod 5th generation so not sure if the themes are different. Uh, actually I can show you real quick. So if we go back to the website here and we go to themes you can see everything that they have themes for all the media players that you can do Rockbox on and stuff like that so you can do it on first generation, second generation, iPod G, uh, the third generation for classic, color photo, iPod minis, iPod nanos, iPod video and mine's the iPod video, I'd click on that you can also use the iPod Classic um, themes, they're basically the same thing. Um, but obviously for the other ones like iPod Mini, you know, you only have 10 themes for that. We'll click on that real quick. And yeah, that doesn't really look too crazy if you're rocking an iPod Mini, but you get something. Let's go on to, let's do iPod Nano, because that has a colored screen. So. Yeah, you basically get obviously like scaled down versions of what the iPod video and stuff has. So nothing too bad. Definitely some more options there. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show that off real quick because I know some of the videos I've seen haven't explained how to do themes. They just show you how to either download it or download emulators on it. All great videos though, so just thought I'd show off the theme thing because even though it's pretty simple to do, it might help if you watch this video make it that much easier to figure it out but um, other than that I'll try to post some more videos soon uh, just been kinda crazy with you know obviously coronavirus and stuff like that and all this crap I've got to figure out some personal issues of mine but just thought I'd make this quick video I'm loving my iPod video I think it's awesome and I think you should definitely get one or any kind of iPod in, in general just because it's nice to get away from your smartphone every once in a while and just click a song and put shuffle on and let it go to town and <laughs> not have to worry about looking at your phone and stuff like that. But with that said, I'll see you guys later and hopefully have a new video out soon. See ya.